first of all, big thank you for all our followers. If you're not yet following us, don't forget, click subscribe. And I mean that. I'm not going anywhere until you hit that subscribe button. Ring that little bell. Yeah? So now you're like a little cheeky bell ring ring. And then, uh, yeah, give us a little follow. And you're going to have some epic journeys with us in 2020. Have a look back at our old videos as well of 2019. We've had some incredible rides. You get a laugh at my falls. But today is a special day as we are going to do a certain journey. What is it, 140 miles? 140 miles. We've got 43 minutes till we get there. I didn't do any videos until now because it was pitch black. Uh, 11.30 last night, Roberto basically uh, said, I'm going to do something. And I was like, right, okay. Will you come with me? Yeah. Yeah, I'll come with you. What time? Early. Okay. Cool. So, uh, Mr. Robert, what are we doing? We are swapping the CRF 450 for a nice new bike. It'll be new to me, but guys just gotta tell me what you think if it was a good idea to do it or or not or not so yeah I'm not gonna tell you what the bike is we're gonna let you see it it is a different bike he has got a little bit of reservations with him you don't really feel like you're doing the right thing do you getting rid of the 450 well no it's the 450's done well as it broke down Got through things that I didn't think it would. Got up big hills. Ripped through dirt, up through forestry, done jumps, done track. You look like you go through things like water, like like butter, like literally you just fly through things. And now we're doing this. We're doing a change. And it's a massive change. So like I said, hit that subscribe button. Give us a follow. I'm not telling you nothing more about it until we get there. But until then, it's going to be another 41 minutes until we get there. And the other thing is, let's hope that that guy hasn't tucked us out. Because this is a long ass journey for, well, he hasn't even had a text off him this morning. So we shall see. But here's some videos of the 450 in action. Feeling Bob? Not so bad, tired. Yeah. Long drive. Yeah. I wonder if regret <laughs> is gonna be coming through. Well it's nice to have a look at the new bike. What <coughs> happens if it's dog rough? Well it's just 
been a nice road trip. And it does look lovely down here. Like, we're in Devon, but it's not the Devon that you're probably thinking of. Because right over that seafront, over there, it's, it's Cardiff. It's bloody Cardiff, over there. <laughs> if we had a boat, we'd be quicker. I think we could have. We could have stuck it on the canoes and done it that way. But it does look lovely down here, fair play. So hopefully, nice, decent guy, decent bike. Bob's expecting a little bit of work with it, you know, because nothing in life comes out easy. But that's that's what we like about this, you know, sort of stuff, you know, and makes great videos doing how to's to fix stuff. Get a go for a drive. This is a serious concentration phase. This is. How have you gone from one minute to three minutes? <laughs> well, I missed the turning. He, he missed the turning. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is Robert View. Distracted, he's feeling probably a bit nervous. He's running on fumes. Uh, and we're doing a swing. Oh, almost crashing into rocks and walls. And I need a poo, I'm not gonna lie. Sorry to tell the world. I actually think I need a poo. <laughs> but I do. Right. Next video you see, guys, is of the bike. The swap. The swap. Hey, guys, so uh, <laughs> moment of truth. We've just done the swap. Rob's picked it up. I really like it, but I don't know if Rob is feeling the love yet. But one thing I do know is he's not feeling the love in a certain place. How's that, Bob? Killing. Don't kick a bike without boots. <laughs> it's bad. So, moment of truth. I don't know if you saw any of the colour then sticking out in any of the corners, but he has picked up a two stroke 2006 KTM 300 EXC. What a fantastic bike. Needs new tyres. A little dent in the can at the front which is expected but other than that i really like it it's got so much compression it's unreal and it was fast for you wasn't it it was a quick bike and you're in a lot of pain aren't you <laughs> yeah. i think i chipped the bone i think you have chipped the bone let's get this thing home we've got another two and a half hours to go what's up guys so uh it's kind of a special video and uh at the start of the video, you saw uh, Rob pick up his bike, nice bike, but he uh, he hasn't gone over it yet because you've got a bit of a boo-boo, haven't you? Yeah. And uh, we went to show the video today and then basically he didn't have no fuel in his bike to, to show it, so as I saw it, I got a little bit jealous. Not jealous, envious I'd say, and I was like, do you know what? I'm gonna put mine up for a swap or for sale. And out of nowhere, this, this guy just literally was just like, you messaged my mate for a swap. Um, I have something that might interest you. So I was like, cool, fire away. So we were chatting away. And uh, yeah, we're on our way now. This is the following day. So Rob got his bike yesterday. Kind of the same sort of story. You were talking to the guy the night before that. And uh, we're talking, and Rob said to me at like half 11 at night, do you fancy going for a drive? And uh, I did the same to him last night. And I was like, five o'clock, let's go meet this guy. So, I'm not gonna tell you what it is. You're probably thinking it's gonna be the same as Rob's, but it's not. So, I will show you when we get it. So, cheers. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> that was a good thing. That's very late. We should have said hi at the start. We should have. So maybe I'll put this at the start and you'll be like, what is the on about? I don't know, I might just leave it as that because this is really awkward. Then you can see that this is just raw. We don't even rehearse our stuff. We just go straight in and do it. So, cool. So, just got back now and uh, thankfully the guy liked my bike because obviously it was a nice bike. I did enjoy it, but this guy has looked after this particular bike and I mean, it's super clean, isn't it, Rob? It is clean. 
is madness like but uh had to go on it absolutely loved it it's a different kettle of fish for me like because i'm obviously used to four stroke um and i'm not used to two stroke but uh yeah i think we'll get a video of it in the morning so it's back to the next day then and uh yeah basically i've just let rob have a go on the bike and uh, i've got it all insured now so that's all good and uh yeah just going over it just to make sure it's hunky dory the way we like it uh it cuts out after it idles a little bit so i think that's a carb sort of aspect bit of a rattly noise in it but i've done some googling and they say that the uh the bike, which I'll announce when it comes, has a, just, just the bike. But I don't settle too well with that sort of stuff, so I like to have a little look. But as soon as uh, Rob gets back, you get to see what I've got. And then uh, we'll also go over what Rob's got. And uh, yeah, like we say at the start, don't forget to click subscribe and uh, ring that bell. Whee! There he was. Does he give it a wheelie? You like it? Yeah. Fun? It is fun. It's light as hell, isn't it? What's your verdict? It's just carb. It's carb, isn't it? Uh, Fuel screw? Twenty eight and top end. Dies. Yeah. It's just Bogs out, doesn't it? And there it is guys. KTM two hundred EXC two thousand and one. And that is the introduction for that bike. Tell me what you guys think. If you like them, if you don't, why? And yeah.